Hi, I'm Kirsty, and this is Human Ink Discovery Voyager Online. Hi everyone, I'm Andrea, and this is UNE Discovery Voyager Online. Hi, it's Kieran here from UNE Discovery Voyager Online. Hi, I'm Anita, and this is UNE Discovery Voyager Online. Hi, I'm Phil, and this is Discovery Voyager Online. Hello everyone, this is Dr. Jean from UNE Discovery. Like many people across the world at the moment, I'm working from home. So I'm filming this video in my kitchen. Hi, it's George the geologist here. I'm just checking how good the wind is with my new microphone. Okay, okay. you stand there and mm -hmm. then I might move that all the way over there. Is that recording? Yeah. Okay. Right. Is that shot okay? Okay, yes, and checking out that whether it'll work or not. Let's see. One, two, three, four, five. Hi everyone, I'm Anita and this is you and he Discovery, blah blah. And we're going to do an experiment today about this. Final scene, take one. Three, two, one. That will heat up all the air inside the bottle. Oh. Go there and so we've got Arlo here on a 30 meter rope. Go, winnie, winnie, winnie. Now to calculate their speed, we do a little bit of maths. And if we do that, we end up with a number of 294 million metres per second as the speed that we've calculated. What you can see there is black carbon. This is a combustion reaction. Our pH, cabbage pH indicator, tie-dye blue lab coat. Should we see what happens when we drop them? All right, egg and spoon race ready. Three, two, one. <laughs> Your imagination is the limit. You can arrange them into the into a. Now, what do you think? What's going to happen when I stick this skewer in? I'll try that again. So the water there is sitting on top, sorry, the water there is sitting on the bottom. So the distance between the adjacent peaks is half a wavelength. And what happens in the microwave? The dive, all the crystals that were on the bottom uh, have stayed in the jar. So once you've finished your... I'm going to get the gifts and stuff on Hi, I'm Phil, and this is the Discovery Voyager online. I forgot to say you're ready. <laughs> okay. Take two. Sorry. Hey, Kieran, do you mind taking yeah. this up to Kirsty to sign? Sure. Thanks. Hey, Kirsty, oh, can you just sign? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, watch out. Quick, we need more undies. Oh, okay. Kirsty, quick, it's an emergency. I need some more undies. I've got just what you need, Kieran. Oh, 
Awesome. Thank you. No worries. So once you've finished your insect collection, your imagination will stop laughing. This is not helping me. Join us. We'll be soiling our undies at the Kirby Smart Farm right here. What you're going to need for this then is this. Oh, look, here is where we soil our undies. Two, two's a win. That's how we soil our undies. So, obviously filling a watering can with water is pretty straightforward. No, 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 anyone know a good song, a little dance maybe? <laughs> it's been eight weeks since we soiled our undies. We're now in December, which has that magical day in it. Christmas. No, World Soils Day, the 5th of December. We... Now you can see I've already found my pants. We should be able to liberate our pants. Put my finger through these holes here. And we can't wait to see your pants. We want to see just how great your pants are all across Australia. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Oh, now I'm not, I know you're going to be laughing over there. All right. Okay. Hey, Kirsty, do you have a lump of coal? I do, Kieran. Oh, thanks. No problem. <laughs> The Natural History Museum with Tiny the Bat once again. Hello, Tiny. Hello. Oh, they're pretty cool creatures. I'm not that keen on them, really. What's mm. that one there? Um, Let's have a look at our key. Myself. It's a squirrel glider. All right, I didn't know that. <gasps> Andrea, there's me. <gasps> there's you, Tiny. It's a lesser long eared bat. Wow. Very good. Thank you for showing us all your friends, Tiny. Oh, hi. 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 Oh, hello. Hey Leanne, yeah. uh, really quick, we need a like really big periodic table. Oh, sure. I have one of those. How's that? Oh, perfect. Is that exactly what you want? Yeah. Great. Cool. Thank you. Cool. No worries. <laughs> good, 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 good vibration. <laughs> Kirsty, do you have a trolley I could borrow? I do, Kieran. Here's one I prepared earlier. Huh, oh, thank you. Yum. But we're not going to eat them, we're going to put them in our experiment. No, that probably won't taste very nice. I've got a mouse that I'm going to show you. See our rock getting eroded. Oh, actually, I more than that. To extract some DNA from a strawberry. So he's our mouth eating some sherbet. Oh, I can see it fizzing. We're going to make our marshmallows grow. Wow, it's almost doubled in size there. Wow, fancy this being something you can do science with. Mmm, delicious. So we'd love you guys to play along at home with this. Grab all your bits and pieces and, and have a look at that experiment card. We can't wait to see your results. Have fun. Well, that's it from me. Thank you so much for joining me. I hope that you have enjoyed this video and I hope that you have fun making and playing with your insect collections. Take care. Thanks for watching. Um, I hope you enjoyed and hopefully we'll come out to your school soon and show this to you in person. Catch you later. Anyway, hope you enjoy exploring that and let us know how well it went. See you next time. Bye. And we'll see you next time on Discovering Voyager Online.
Hang on, I'm just going to film one last bit. Mm -hmm. Okay. 